Hello, everybody. Mark Silverman, the founder of NetPix here. I've gotten a lot of requests for a video like this to talk about what's been going on in the cryptocurrency markets and what the opportunities might be for all of you. So that's what I want to do in this very short video. It's been very exciting times, as you may be aware, here in 2023, and it's looking quite encouraging into next year. All right, I think there's no question that the cryptocurrency markets right now, the markets that can't stop and they won't stop, despite everything that's being thrown uh, at these markets. And there's been a lot. It can be a bit of a roller coaster. So how do we make sense of that roller coaster ride and put ourselves in a position to profit from the longer term, despite the up and down movement? Some of the best news is we've had some pretty amazing price increases here in 2023. But the biggest catalysts we believe are still to come. One of those is the approval of the Bitcoin and Ethereum ETF, which could take place any day at this point. There's no guarantees ever, but it is definitely going to be a major catalyst to get institutional level investing into the space. There's the Bitcoin halving event, which I'll cover in more details towards the end. Historically, this has been a major run up ahead of this event, which is going to be approximately April 2024. And then after is when the biggest gains happen. There's so much opportunity to come. And we've been accumulating all year. We have what we call our Elite 7 portfolio markets, and these include Bitcoin, Ethereum, Avalanche, Polygon, Matic, Chainlink, Polkadot, and Solana. Let me jump over to some charts and show you some places that we've been buying uh, with this portfolio and see if there's any additional new buying opportunities setting up for all of us. So this is a chart of Bitcoin, and these are the places that we have been buying throughout 2023. In fact, what you see here is a daily chart, and these dots here represent our buy points. We bought this right at the beginning of 2023 at 18,558. Now we're feeling really good about that buy point and additional buy points that we've had. The reason this feels really good is pricing has been as high as 38,000 right now. In fact, up 105% from our first buy point uh, on the year overall. And we will see additional places to accumulate for a lot of people when they trade markets, right? When they see the price go down, they see it as a problem. We look at it as a potential opportunity to buy these markets on sale. Now, when I'm recording this in real time, we still need a pullback to this lower channel. Once that happens, we will get our next buy point. It is starting to happen on some of the other markets in our Elite 7. Let me show you. So this is Polygon Matic. The one thing you'll see is we tend not to be buying when the markets are in a decline, especially a strong decline. When I go ahead and dollar cost average into a market, I don't want to do it blindly. I want to buy at intelligent buy points. And you can see in the last couple of months, we've had two levels. And this market has run up to almost $1, which is just about under 100% return at its best buy point. Now, we're starting to see a pullback here. There was some recent news that came out the last couple of days that has caused a short-term sell-off. We don't quite yet have our next buy point, but it's starting to come close. It looks like it could be happening here over the next several days. That is another opportunity to position into these markets. So let me show you why that's so important. So the market I'm showing you here now is also one of the markets in our Elite 7, one of the ones we believe you should have exposure to. Of course, everybody should have some Bitcoin and Ethereum. That's, to me, a given. And the ones I'm sharing with you, such as Polygon, Matic, Avalanche, Chainlink, these will be the next to add to your portfolio. During 2023, we had buy points that looked like you see on the screen. Right, six dollars and thirty-seven cents, seven fifty-six, six oh two, six sixty-eight. You would say, looking at this, what a mess, what a crazy up and down market. That's the roller coaster. Will this pay off ultimately with these buy points? Now we never bought in the huge declines. Our system indicated to us that we should start to add to the position. Now, is this the payoff just yet? No, but this is the whole idea of buying on sale at smart buy points, not overdoing it and adding to it as those opportunities come up. The reason for that is because what happens typically next is something like this. The market starts to take off to the upside. This all happened over the last few weeks. Look where this market went to here recently, all the way up to almost $17. So nearly a triple on our lowest buy point and all of our buy points were well rewarded from 50% to 100% or more. And we're starting to get the next thing to happen in the cycle. We want a sell-off to happen. I don't want it to go straight up because what a lot of people do is they buy at the top because that's when all the positive news comes in and everybody jumps in and they jump in at these levels and then a sell-off happens. I need to wait on that sell-off and then look to reestablish positions. That's the reason that we establish our intelligent buy points in our Elite 7 portfolio. I'll share in a moment a way that you can get those buy points if you happen to be interested in these. Now, our next opportunity in cryptocurrency trading is number one, 
establish ourselves with Bitcoin and Ethereum and then consider adding for longer term holds what we call the Elite 7 portfolio. However, there's a whole other tier where there is tremendous short-term opportunity where we don't need to decide if that market is going to be a long-term winner because that can be quite difficult in any market. There's so many opportunities out there. These are trades that we're looking to get in and get out. Typically, we're looking for 20% profit on a successful trade, and then we look to trail for 50%, 100%, 150%, and we don't fall in love with any of these markets. We just get in, get out, and we're done. And that's the second way that we add active trading into our approach to cryptocurrency trading. Let me show you some recent examples and then also show you some brand new trades that we see are setting up right now. With our crypto rockets, we track about 25 markets to trade that have the tendency to take off quickly. One of those markets is injective protocol. It's one of our, my favorite to trades, INJUSD, one I would definitely consider for active trading. We had a trade set up here a couple months ago. And like I mentioned, we're looking for 20% profit targets initially. And then I'm looking for the rocket ship move. Now this one, no problem in a few days hit the 20% target and pretty much doubled up on that. Got to about 40, 50% before it rolled over. But we do not keep these long-term. Unlike the Elite 7, which I'm looking to hold on to for the bigger moves over 6 to 24 months, these are markets that I don't fall in love with. I'm looking to get in, get my profits, and get out as quick as possible. So we would have exited this market on our trailing stop looking for a new opportunity, which we did get right here in September. And we got into this market in the middle of September. And look what happened in this case. This is the ultimate crypto rocket trade, easily 20% right now, and then the rocket ship to the upside. At that point, towards its peak, was up over 100 and 54%. The exciting news now is we finally got a brand new setup on this market. Over the last few days, we've gotten the sell-off and you'll notice we have set up brand new setups here at about 17,950. That is our new buy point on this market. Now this will update on a daily basis because if this market continues to sell off, we will adjust this entry down. But it's exciting to see where we have one of our favorite markets that just finished up to 150% move is now saying, hey, there is a new setup. Why that's so important is you have markets like Maker, MKRUSD, where, again, just a couple months ago, we had a buy level here that easily hit the 20%, then went up to 43%, and then ever higher. This, again, was another one over 100%. This is that pullback I just showed you on Injective. Very similar. Right? You get the pullback. We get a series of buys on the daily chart. Eventually, we get our best one to fill. This was right at the beginning of September. And look what happened. It took off again. Now, does every trade work? No, we can't be successful in every setup either. I would say in these setups, at least two out of three on the bullish side are successful. 20%, 50%, 100% or more. Here's another setup here. It looked perfect. We would absolutely get in on this. But sometimes the market also rolls over. We didn't quite get a 20% move here. So we end up taking a loss on the trade. You have to accept that with this type of active trading. But what happens again? I get another setup. So here I am in real time. We've just gone long on this one at about 14.34 or so. The market's just a little bit above that, and we are currently long. We don't yet have our rocket ship move, but here we are in real time with a trade on MKR USD. Let me show you MENA USD. This market is set up in the middle of October. I had a setup. It took about a week to enter, which is great because I just placed the trade in advance. I don't really care when it fills. It fills, and then it went 100 and 40% in just a few days. I mean, this was an amazing candle. By the way, I got to repeat this. We are still early days in the rally for these altcoin markets. In fact, the market cap on this, I believe at this point is about 25% of what it was at the peak when we saw that back in 2021. So yes, you may have missed some early moves here, but this is just getting going. In fact, we've had the sell-off, the consolidation, and now brand new setup for this market here at 0.682 that we would be happy to get into because the odds are in our favor on every one of these trades that we take. It's not perfect. This could be a losing trade, of course, but we know that when we have this set up, the odds are good that we will have success on that. I'm loving the fact that we are starting to get a little bit of correction in the price movement over the last several days because this could be setting up the next wave higher for us. What I'm excited about is you can see on this list here, these are all the markets that we are trading. It can be traded at any exchange. But what you're seeing is all the markets that are currently open are in green or red. Only one market is in red. By the way, about a week ago, every single market was green because we were in such a amazing upswing. But now we're starting to see this correction that is setting up brand new buy opportunities, which for me is exciting because markets like Ave at 100.97, 
ARB at 1.1638. These are brand new buy points that we can look to get into that are setting up in real time. All of these we finished up on our last successful buys, and now we're getting brand new ones. You can see INJ that I mentioned to you before has a brand new setup. Another gray market we've traded quite a bit is IOTX. Anything here that does not have a current date is a brand new trade. OMG USD, brand new trade. Perpetual, brand new trade. Uh, Rose USD, this has been a very good market for us. 0.07478, brand new trade. Now these will update on a daily basis if they do not fill, but we are starting to see another round of opportunities. And this cycle is going to repeat over and over again into the Bitcoin having next year and beyond. So the final question I have, I wanted to share that with you just to show you where we're seeing success is, would you like to learn more about our Elite 7 portfolio for the longer term buy and holds, as well as the active trading with the Crypto Rockets trading? I'm going to put a link on the screen. I'll put in the YouTube video down below. It's getnetpicks.com slash Elite 7. I have a very short video there where I share with you an opportunity. If you're interested in getting those intelligent buy points on the Elite 7, as well as a second opportunity when you go to that uh, page in order to learn about the Crypto Rocket strategy. We believe every portfolio should have some exposure to cryptocurrency. It does not have to be high. This is absolutely a higher risk, high reward opportunity. But 5% to 10% of your portfolio having exposure could very well outperform the other 90 to 95%, especially if we get a continuation of the early days of the bull cycle we're seeing. It's not going to be straight up. It's not going to never have a sell-off. It's not going to ever not go down. But realize when the prices come back down, that is your next opportunity to reestablish yourself at a new and improved buy point. So if you'd like to explore the opportunities, including getting these daily trade alerts, just go to the link on the screen, getnetpicks.com slash elite seven. No obligation. You'll learn more about it. I'll share more of the markets that we're trading. And if it's of interest to you, you'll have an opportunity there to learn some more. I'm also going to share with you more to the story, the markets and the catalyst to come, why we expect there's a very high odds, higher prices over the next weeks and months to come. Do me a favor and leave comments down below. If you have any markets you want us to take a look at, we'll be happy to take a look at those with our Elite 7 system or a Crypto Rockets to see if we're also identifying some buy opportunities. So feel free to leave those below. I'll reply back to uh, all of those comments. If you're currently in any of these markets or some others, I share that as well. Share that below as well. If you have any other questions or comments about the cryptocurrency markets trading, you've considered it, you haven't, anything that you need help with, more than happy to reply uh, to your comments down below. So I always encourage that, interact uh, with us. I'll just leave any comments uh, on these trades, other markets, other setups you may be looking at, more than happy to help you out. All right, well, appreciate it. Thanks for listening. Hope to see you over at the next video.